Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm not spending a lot of bombs there. No. Um, can those rewind back there? No. Oh, maybe I can. Steady. Yeah. Hi. Why is it black and white? Oh, okay. I'm sure we're winding time. Uh, it's just long the stones. Later, I'll come back here. And blow those up. Because I'll probably fall down there. Yeah. And I don't really want to... To have to... Have them this fall. Phantom Helmet. Myths abound about armor phantoms that terrorize brave heroes. This helmet looks just like the ones they supposedly wore. It's a rather rare find. Oh. Man, this boss sucks. Okay, now let's teleport back to there. Huh. Hello, mind if I ask about something that's troubled my thoughts? Have you perchance seen a rather strange animal around here? Uh, also, I heard the sound of a flute. Well, this sound, the music here has a flute somewhere. Is vexing really? Not knowing where this coming from, strange animal. That's right, it was a stocky animal that was wider than a horse and had strange horns. Ah, the rumored beast. I thought you were talking about the the white horse. Um, but not like a cows or goats. Oh, and he had tusks that made the beast look like a little brute. I saw the animal once in the forest off to the east. I rushed closer to get a good look, but it ran off by the time I got there. I never see anything like it. I must say the whole experience was shocking. Some travelers passed through here from Lakeside Stable and they said they see a similar animal. So maybe I'll find it again somewhere. Strange animal. The sound of a flute nearby. And really, there's so much to be worried about these days. I will be able to ride all of those. A flute sound? Oh, I just remembered. While thinking of that strange animal, I was walking through the trees on the north side of the stable. Out of nowhere, I could hear someone playing a fun tune on a flute. Ah, okay, it's probably somebody from, from the troop. Okay. But I couldn't see who it was, not even the slightest sign of this mysterious musician. Who, uh, who was playing? In where? 
Okay, you're the one there. Piper. Good grief, where did Piper go? Hey, can you believe it? My friend Piper lived part of the field outside on fire, flowers and all. He's always trying to get a laugh out of me. But it was that wasn't funny. What was he thinking? He said he was about to show me a glowing tree. I mean, that sounds nice, but when I saw what he was about to do, I told him not to. Still he did, and that happened, and now he's vanished into thin air. Well, given it's Piper, I bet he's only hiding somewhere playing his flute. And she'd never mentioned to you she's been hearing a flute. And she's never seen Piper around here to know about it. Oh, the dog. Good dog. So, I bet you climbed up here with me for some good reason. Need something? Oh, uh, hey, did you come to listen to my performance? Are you a stable trotter? I want you to hear you play. Uh -huh. Alright, you look like you use a smile. Uh, so, just for you, I'll put on one of my finest performances. Oh! He moves to the song. Again, it's uh, from me after all. Are you a stable trotter? Huh? You met the stable trotters. Oh, the troop is turning again, and they want all of us musicians back. That's great. But first, I have something to do here. I can go back to the stable trotters until I take care of it. Come on, let's move this down there where it's safer. I need to tell you what's happening here. But I guess I won't complete his quest now because I want. Otherwise, he might go find them by himself. I uh, want them to ask for me to find him. Uh. What happened, not that you probably haven't heard already, is that there was a fire in the field. Yeah, right on this spot, uh, and this burnt patch around us. Uh. Uh, there were some flowers here before. It was all my fault, an accident, but it's still my fault. You see, I have a friend who lives at the stable. Her name is H. Mm, H? Uh, maybe you've met her? She's been asking people if she could see a glowing tree. It's just something from a picture book. You know, it's not real, but she really wishes it was. I promised her that I'd show her one. Not my brightest idea, uh, given they don't exist. And then I was stuck, so I thought I'd use just a little tree and a little fire and make a glowing tree really quick, that's all. Aww. That's how things got burned here, but I was only thinking of my promise to hate. Besides, it didn't even work. Aww. I would still like to surprise her with a glowing tree somehow, but safely. So now I'm collecting fireflies. Uh, I need only 10 or more sunset fireflies, and then I'll have enough to make a whole tree glow. 
They'll make it smile. Uh, do you have some fireflies with you? I'm sure I, I see a glow coming from your pouch. I need 10 more of those sons of fireflies make going tree. No, I think you may live here, so I'll wait for them to ask me. Catching sons of fireflies is hard. I really need to gather all those sons of fireflies soon so I can show hate you that glowing tree. Hey. No, I'm not doing a speed run. <laughs> Where's my horse? What's it around here? Why did it go all the way there? Um, I think I whistled inside the cave. Man, nobody had a quest for me, so I'm just fine by myself. The giant white horse. Oh. Ah, good. Actually, let's hit it first. Electro-price balls were new. I didn't notice. This one was well disguised. Just alongside the road like that. Stone Talus shield. Oh, well, it should be strong. Yep. Mm. Let's go there on my way back. Oh no, my way back I'll probably be with the horse. So, young man, tell me, you seek the horse god? No, I met him. <laughs> uh, he does not. A quick study on his, on his face gives him away. He's got the giant white stallion on his mind. And who could blame him? I'm right, right? Horse god? Ooh. There's been strange talk for a good while about horse god, one that lives here among us. 
I believe it's more than just a legend, or at least I hope so. It said this god can bring horses back from the dead. Mm. Uh, that all might seem laughable, even preposterous. But my friend and I study horses, and if such a god exists here and can resurrect horses, then what about ancient horses? The mind reels the, at the possibilities. I'm willing to suspend my disbelief in, in the horse god for the sake of ancient research. So my search goes on. Uh. But there's a complication. They say this god moved and that he was here but vanished. Fortunately, tales of the horse god also abound in this and the color. It's looking more and more likely that the god is not here if he exists at all. He could be somewhere in Akala. He's quite well known in Akala. Wait just a minute there. You're not saying that we are going to Akala, are you? Because we're not. Our main research here is our main research is here. We've got to see the giant white stallion. Giant white stallion. Oh yes, my curiosity about this highly notable horse has drawn me here. I've seen it deep within this valley. I can verify that it lives up to the description, it's giant, it's wide and it's a stallion, extremely rare. The latest talk in our field of study calls such rare traits a mutation. We are doing research into the ecology of all the wild animals in this area. Oh, that such a rare horse exists, we want to study this creature and see its unusual traits of clothes. Mm. But I said, okay, you can guess the stallion is very strong. The marvelous creature refused to be anything, to have anything to do with us, it escapes us every time, it won't be tamed. Mm. And yes, I know, our search into the giant white stallion is paramount. But if there's a horse got somewhere, I really want to know about it. Could this be a way to get a Pona if you didn't have the Amiibo? Oh. Resurrecting an ancient horse? Well then, good talking. We'd appreciate it if you share with us anything more you hear about the horse god. Oh. Uh, horse god Melania? No. What did you say? Do you mean to tell me you've met the horse god? Oh, mm, I see. Yes, yes. Oh. I don't believe it. The legend is real. And it is true that a god can resurrect a horse from the dead. Oh. Well then, I can't help thinking. Shall I eat you? Huh? Uh, those words are worrisome. How much can we begin to trust a god to say something like that? Oh. Mm. As much as I wanted to meet this god, I say we must be cautious. Mm. Right, given that we haven't captured the giant white stallion yet, and haven't seen it up close, haven't seen it close up, uh, that should be our priority. Oh. Agreed, yes. The local habitat of the giant white stallion give us plenty of research at this time. Okay, I'll go grab it. But that should be a quest. I had a quest for the other horses. Come on. Oh, beautiful. Ah, uh, it's way off center. But all the butterflies are there. Yeah, let's leave that one. It has the butterflies. Um, this massive animal is thought to share its lineage with the white horses ridden by Highland royalty. Called a giant white stallion due to its color and normal size, this horse is believed to have been a result of sudden mutation. There are many travelers and researchers keen to seek out this extraordinary creature. I thought it was... An offspring of both the white one and the Gerud Stallion. <laughs> How far do you go? You're gonna get yourself stuck. Okay, so I'll need to return later. Oh no, I, I think I have stamina food. Did you see it? 
It's right here. Not that much. Okay. Oh, there was just a little bit more that I needed. No. Don't get angry. We'll be friends. Whoa, the horse. That must be. There's no mistaking it. There's a giant white stallion we've been trying to research. Seeing this up close, this close up, the horse is just so intimidating. It's so large. I feel so small. Words fail me. One thing I can say with certainty is that a mutation is in play here. What a discovery. A horse of this size, capturing it must have been hard. In riding it, next to impossible. Young man, you are remarkable. I mean, I got the reward already, but I wanted this real quest. Incredible that big is a that is a big horse. I don't think I ever see, feel anything but all being next to that animal. It's so big, in fact, the horse riding equipment just wouldn't fit its main frame. You can tell that giant white stallion has giant temper to match. Can't imagine that he listens to just anyone. Training such a horse must be quite trying to quite must be. Like trying to quiet a storm. Oh, I know. Let's grab something here. Uh, large. Then we'll drop it down there. Flat. Okay, that was some good thinking. I was going to jump here and climb back up. Come on. Nice. Oh, what a splendid horse do you want to resist? Right? Yes, please. Understood. Your horse will be in good hands. Oh, what name? Uh, stand in the pool. He kind of looks like a Saiyajin. A Saiyan. Yeah, here we call them Saiyajins. But no, the others have Zelda names. Demise. Maria. Knight. Mm. Can we change their names afterwards? I think there was somebody that could change their names. It kind of reminds me of the white, the light spirits from Dark Princess. Well, we are south of Faron, so let's call it Ordon. And it's the other one out. Or Ordona. Ordona, the name of the spirit that is missing. Yeah, that's a good name. Oh. Uh, yeah, let's take horse. Nah. Take Indigo Go. Oh, yeah, I forgot to change Indigo Go's gear. Nah. And what's your gear? <laughs> it's the same of the other stallion. Uh, it looks like Gerudo, but I'm not sure. Nah. Uh, keep your horse. Wait. You like to keep your horse mm -hmm. with? Uh, scratch that. We don't actually have any other saddles or bridles big enough for a horse that size. And I don't think this steel would want me to mess with its main eater. Uh, but if you ask me, there's no need to make changes anyway. Your horse looks great without them. Mm, yeah, I'm 
not sure I, I like this set on it now. Um, your horse looks really hot. Yeah. Uh, have a look at this sky northeast. There's an, a natural black cloud over there. Lots of rainy. Gives me the creeps. Hasn't moved up since upheaval. Not even a strong wind can make it budge. What do you think's going on there? Let's just check the pirate ship. Ah, there it is. Oh. He's trolling on the beach. Blue main line now. Should I? Hmm. I read that already. Streets of monsters are living hearts each time. Besides the intelligence and resilience. Receive horn. Yeah. I read that. Ah, yeah, it's that I die the fight and stuff. That's a low resolution. I didn't notice the images here are in a lower resolution. The most heavily harvested since ancient times compared to the standard line note, the those blue mains are much tougher with much sharper horns. Uh, facing off against a lino is ill advice, but if you must, be sure you're very well prepared. Hip. that anyway, if I don't use here. I have to detain that. Being too close doesn't help. safe here. Ah, but it's still got shields. Oh. Mm, they don't have 
Do I know swords anymore? Why do I know bow? Things a bit different. Blue main lino, saber horn, the sharp blade like horn of a blue main lino, attached to a weapon to moderately increase its attack power. Cook the creature to make elixir. Blue main lino, mace horn, its ends are split apart, but this horn from a blue main lino is solid, attached to a weapon to moderately increase its attack power or bring it an elixir. Mighty Lino Shield, this Lino Mage Shield has been reinforced with armor and even more blades, stronger in both defense and offense. It can tear through base armor when deflecting. The first one I met was... He was using a two-handed weapon, right? He didn't have a normal Lino Shield. Mighty Lino Bow, uh, this massive Lino Bow sports a bow string made from metal so tough Mayor Hylios had trouble running back. Oh, this would be quite good. Hmm, I thought this would be a bit better. Hmm. Uh, usually there are some... Ah, there you are. Oh, you guys have a Gorons with you. Oh. Wow, there are plenty of people here. Ercus, uh, so, uh, you're gonna join the fight too? Huh? Stop right there. You can just walk up to my squad and start jabbering at them like that. Oh, uh, oh hey, I thought I recognized you from somewhere. Have we met? Don't you remember me? Come on, we chatted back at Lookout Landing. No. <laughs> anyway, let me introduce myself again. I am the captain of the Squad 3 of... Ah, oh, so there's one more? I don't think I met Squad 2. Of the Monster Control Crew. Name is Flexo, nice to meet you. <laughs> we were just on our way to rough up those monsters over there. Uh... But the bridge to the ship collapsed, so we don't have any way to board it. We can give those monsters a real whooping if we can just get the bridge fixed. Bring peace to Pharaoh. Uh, so I'm gonna fight you. Hmm. Come on, everyone's real stressed out right now, so don't go past anyone, okay? Uh. Let's cross the broken bridge, we're going to the ship, fix the bridge. Yeah, so guys aren't doing anything. I'm gonna get an earful from the captain if she finds out you loitering around. Uh. Uh. Ah! Sorry, but this really is good time to chat. Mm. Uh. Rafa, do you need something now? So I should go talk to Captain. Uh. Hang on, I don't know these people. And you guys will vanish from here uh. probably afterwards. What do you want? We're in the middle of an important mission right now. Uh. Rayburn, uh, I've got to focus on the battle, so no talking. Uh. Uh. Alright, alright. Well, I don't really need to fix the bridge for you guys. I can probably take care of them by myself. Yeah, I'm more interested to see what you guys will say once I do it all by myself than... Actually... I kinda wanna drop the bridge when you guys are crossing. <laughs> Oh, it broke the game. Come on, it's green. Grab it, pull it, snap it. What's wrong? Huh? Uh, I probably had to attach to the exact way that you get fixed uh, and then I won't be able to break it back yeah I'm gonna go 
murder them and I'll be back shortly. Uh, yeah, that works. Okay, who's first? A warrior, incredible. Ah. You have to be rewarded. Do you have a minute? Did you guys care that I did it by myself? <laughs> uh, did you ever surprise me? And there we were, totally fluxing by the collapse bridge. Then you come swooping in and wipe out every last monster all by yourself, too. Great. Ah. Oh, hey, I've still got to give you a reward. Silver rupee. Good. <laughs> We have to train, we have to get stronger, we have to get ready for what's next. The plan is to head northwest to the South Tabanta Snowfield in Hebrew. If we happen to meet again, consider fighting beside us, okay? <laughs> May the goddess highly keep you safe, brave warrior. Okay. I haven't met with uh, Turing again, but I... From what he said, I guess... The monsters would respawn and then we would need to they would need to go back to on their patrol killing every monster again. Okay, now it works. Ah, so maybe I could break it. Okay, next time I'll try to break it with one of them crossing. I was just afraid that it would stay fixed if I attach to the right position. Uh, uh, okay, horse, let's go back. Oh, oh, oh. 